Hi, I'm Jonathan Naylor coming to you live on site at the Harvest Time campus with the Phase 2 Harvest Time News. With me, I have Larry DeLuca, who's been excavating this site and who will uh, be laying a drainage pipe from this site to the very edge of our property. Welcome, Larry. Thank you, Jonathan. My pleasure. Larry, I understand you started the excavation in December. Now, that's the middle of winter. Uh, how did you manage to uh, move all this material uh, during the winter and and uh, continue uh, to do the excavating under the, those harsh circumstances? Um, the circumstances were definitely not on our side. There's a large amount of water and ledge rock, as you could see, throughout the sides of the banks, which are shale, bedrock, and, of course, a layer of about four feet of dirt on top. Uh, which is a challenge to dig through because it's three different stages and three different uh, types of applications need to be applied. Hydraulic hammers to break the rock, rock bucket rippers to remove it more efficiently than blasting being that it's not a hard, hard rock, it's easily to be peeled. And the bottom layer is a hard granite stone which requires breaking through the hydraulic hammers that we have on the equipment. Larry, are you almost done with the excavation? Yes, the excavation is complete inside the hole that we're all standing in. It is at grade elevation for footings. The piers are in place and at elevation for columns that support the building, steel columns. The elevator shaft pit, the elevator pit is in. The shoring that you see behind me is to stabilize any collapsing of earth material that's surrounding the existing building. Mm -hmm. We wouldn't want that to come down if we don't have to. Larry, what is this hole here behind us? This hole is the start of our drainage discharge pipe that is going to be the main issue of relieving the water that is going to be inside this hole under our concrete slab. Through gravel, into the manhole structure, which is the starting point mm -hmm. of our drain pipe that is going to the edge of the property, the far side of the parking lot, which is going to exit that way with water that's accumulated through here. Do we have to dig up the parking lot? There's no other way to do it in this instance to have the pipe run through gravity. What advice would you give to uh, stay safe during this time? The most important is to stay clear of any moving objects with this heavy equipment. If we could do that and watch where you're walking and take cautious steps, the project will go very smooth and we'll have no injuries. That's good advice, Larry. So it, we've realized the significant savings and we know that uh, your heart is in this job and uh, you've been very generous with your time and your expertise. And on behalf of the congregation, we thank you sincerely. I thank you also, and I will say this on behalf of my crew and myself, it's been a pleasure working here with some of the people that I've met on this campus have been extremely friendly and nice and easy to work with. And if I will say, the one person is nicer than the next, if you will. This is Jonathan Naylor signing off for Phase 2 Harvest Time News.